For 150 years, our people have been putting the power of kindness into action. They are trailblazers, change makers, and lifesavers of the British Red Cross. Our very first volunteers helped pave the way for countless more, like Princess Sophia Dalip Singh, one of the thousands of VAD nurses who cared for the sick and wounded during World War I, and other volunteers who continued to help people as the war ended and influenza hit the nation hard, showing extraordinary bravery to be there for those who needed it most. Volunteer Percy Lane Oliver set up the UK's first ever blood donation service. And during the Second World War, our volunteers helped families to trace their missing loved ones, a service we still run today for refugees. We've been working alongside the NHS from day one. And with Land Rover ever since the 50s, when they started donating vehicles so workers like Joan Whittington could reach people in places they couldn't before. When a mining disaster left the community of Aberfan stricken with grief, volunteers like John Cole were there to support with kindness. And years later, workers like Helen Cookson stood firmly alongside refugees in Hong Kong, fleeing the war in Vietnam. Princess Diana visited Angola's active minefields with us, leading to a ban on anti-personnel mines. Our Boxing Day tsunami appeal saw an unparalleled outpouring of kindness from the British public. And in 2017, our teams responded to a UK emergency every four hours. And, after years of campaigning, got first aid on school curriculums in 2019, so that more children like Stephen know how to save a life. At the turn of this decade, when the coronavirus pandemic broke out, Thousands joined our movement to support the most vulnerable people. And as we move forward, our vision of a world where everyone gets the help they need in a crisis will be more important than ever. Working together, we will harness the power of kindness to build connected communities that stand strong in the face of the future, whatever it brings.